Hey guys, how you doing? Dave here. Welcome back to Cook and Share. I love steak, I love onions, I love mushrooms, and let's face it, who doesn't? I decided to make up these cheesesteak stuffed peppers. Absolutely incredible and easy. You can make them in about 30 minutes. Everybody will love them. Let me show you how to do this and let's get going. So what I've got here are four red bell peppers, decent size, you can use yellow, you can use green. I just kind of like the red, they're a little sweeter and look a little nicer. And I'm just going to go ahead and slice these in half. Then I'm going to go ahead and trim around the stem. And I'm going to do this for all of these and take those pits out because you don't want to eat those pits, they're not very good. Next up, I'm going to slip these into a baking dish. Well, they look pretty, nothing in them yet. Now I'm going to slip these into a 325 degree Fahrenheit, 160 Celsius, preheated oven for about 30 minutes, just to the point where they're tender. In a pan over medium heat, I'm going to add in some oil, probably a tablespoon or two. And of course we're doing this while the bell peppers are baking. And I'm going to add in my onion, and this is a large chopped onion. And about 16 ounces of button mushrooms. Now you can use shiitake, whatever mushroom you like. I just chose these simply because I had them on hand. I'm going to season this up with some salt. Fairly generous amount. And some ground black pepper. And we're going to stir and fry for about six minutes, just until they're tender. After about six minutes, our mushrooms and onions are fairly tender, and you can see that the onions are translucent here. I'm going to add in, I'm going to add in half a kilo of thinly sliced sirloin. Mmm, this smells incredible, guys. Uh, about a tablespoon of Italian seasoning. And if you don't have this on hand, you can make it. Or I suppose you can just leave it out, but it's kind of nice. And give this a stir and cook it for about three or four minutes until the meat is cooked. After about three minutes, the meat is nicely done, so I'm just going to kill the heat. And that's our meat cooked. After about 30 minutes, our bell peppers are nice and soft. So what I'm going to do is take a slice of mozzarella. You can use polvorone too. I just like mozzarella. Most people have it on hand. And put it inside. Now I'm going to take some of my beef mixture and just put it into the center. Something like this. Now I'm going to take some more mozzarella and lay it over the top. Wow, this is going to be so good. Now I'm going to slip these back into the oven on broil for about three minutes until they're a beautiful golden brown. After three minutes or so, the cheese is nicely melted and look at these beauties. I'm just going to go ahead and garnish them up with some parsley fresh from the garden. And there you have it, my friends, our cheesesteak stuffed peppers. Incredibly delicious. So let's go ahead and give this a taste test. Mmm, this is so good guys. The steak is tender. The mozzarella, the onions, oh, just incredible. You gotta make this. For the full scoop on this recipe, head on over to cookandshare.com. 
All kinds of great stuff over there. Thanks for watching and subbing, and see you next time.